cleaning out this huge mess. Huge, huge mess. And going to get all this figured out here. A lot of stuff to deal with. And my wife brought some snacks. And my daughter's out here. She's having some fun. <laughs> yeah, finally going to get this Integra repaired. So I got it running right now. And I'm going to show you guys the exhaust here in a little bit. But uh, here is my idea. So I'm going to back the car up. And that way I align it perfectly with the exhaust that's dragging. So I'll show you here. So I'm going to try to get it as close as possible. I'm trying to get it as close as possible under that. Hopefully it doesn't get caught and I can just raise it. My brother doesn't live too far away so uh, he's about 15 minutes. Not even. A little closer than that. But here's the exhaust I bought. Very cheap. I just want to slap something on there real quick so I can just start driving it and save a little bit of money and just enjoy the car a little bit this summer because I am going to work every single day so it would be nice to drive something different other than the SUV and just save miles on that so yeah I'm excited hopefully it goes down uh, we are missing one part but I think we can figure it out with some other pieces and we'll go from there and I finally got my mess all figured out. It was a huge mess, threw a lot of stuff away, and I still have a lot to organize. This is not the final product or the final set, final way the garage is gonna look. But yeah, let's do this. Just charged the battery for almost 24 hours and we almost died this morning with carbon monoxide because of this battery that was charging so and right now I'm gonna pull it out and clean it all up get it ready for the repairs later on today and I'll show you the parts that I purchased and just very excited to get this back on the road again to drive and have some fun. Alright, got the vehicle out finally and reorganized all this crap I have in the garage. Freaking hoarders. Just stuff we don't really want to throw away. Or deciding, I don't know, <clears throat> a lot of personal stuff in here. And I moved my tools that were sitting on this rack back here and transitioning over to the front side where I need it most. So just a little table here that I need to organize stuff and just you know, put tools or whatever on there. And this little three tier, three shelf little shelving unit I found at Menards or Home Depot, I forgot which one. And I'm gonna take apart this bed that my sister gave us so I can get some more room in here. But yeah, the Integra is out there, ready to be cleaned pretty soon. And I'm gonna be going through this mess and organizing all of these bits, tools, and parts. I don't know what's going on here, so I'm gonna get rid of this, or probably use this for bigger tools, and use these trays for, my father gave me these, and I'll use these trays for the sockets and stuff like that. That way I can keep everything organized. But yeah, just slowly transitioning parts up here, 
and moving all this other crap I don't need. Like, there's, look at this complete mess from years and years of hoarding crap since I was in high school. A lot of this crap is from high school. And I just gotta get rid of it. Alright, so we made it to my brother's garage. And the first thing we're gonna work on since the exhaust is extremely hot is the axles. So I'll show you guys the parts I have right now. Yeah, the new parts. Yeah, the new exhaust and header. Alright, so my guy replaced the axle here. Fast, easy. Easy money, baby. Nice. And we just got done removing. I just removed the header. And it's my first time ever doing this, so it's a lot of fun. And here's the old one. And this is like an original racing part, I guess. A racing part <laughs> and here's the new one but I'm convinced that I should put the old one back on just I feel like it's just more better quality than this piece I got these two off eBay for 50 bucks and it wasn't that bad so this is the part we really needed cuz this this exhaust was so bad and the welder who I had worked on the exhaust he cut this end off. I don't know what he was thinking, but we were hoping it's gonna be nice and easy. So yeah, we can get this whole exhaust going. And that's what I'm gonna work on right now is to place these two parts together. And what are these parts called, bro? Which one? These? Those are the gaskets. Okay, these are the gaskets. So I'm gonna put the gaskets on place these on so it's a lot of fun I'm, I'm learning I'm still learning a lot it's a lot of fun
Finally got the Integra up and running. I'm so excited, I'm so happy. Can't believe it. It's been over 14 months. It's sitting pretty good. A lot of plans for this car. Make sure to follow the Instagram. Project Integra with the one. Sorry for the wind guys, it's so windy today. But yeah, today's Monday. I had to go back because the screw got loose on the exhaust and we had to retighten it. But yeah, everything's looking good, it's running great. I got a new battery today this this afternoon. Uh, my battery was shot from yesterday and Sunday and I had a hard time starting it. So yeah, I'm happy. Uh, one of the next major changes I want to make to this car is the new rims, new wheels whatever you want to call it and I don't know I'm still debating what kind of color I'm kind of done with this black and silver that I got going on but the front two tires are pretty good so I'll I'll drive it for the next year and a half but yeah the next major changes will be the wheels and I had a lot of fun building the exhaust with my brother and it's running great I love the stock interior, so 90s, and I gotta fix that down there, that little stitch. And I did clean it up, wiped it down, took the grease off, cleaned the windows, been dusty for a very long time. Uh, not too concerned about the body overall, I'd say 80% of it's pretty solid. The other 20 needs help with rust and dents. So yeah.